let's go. It is May the 2nd, 2018. Driving into work today. And, you know, I was just, I'm not going to lie, I was actually just praying. And, uh, and I started thinking about the next step in the process for me. And, you know, I've talked about how I never wish what I've gone through on anyone. But sometimes you've got to go through hell. You've got to go through some pretty bad stuff to wake you up, to snap you out of it, to, to make you understand that the way that you've been living is, is not going to work. It's just, it's not. And different people have different situations, but but God had to allow certain things to happen in my life to wake me up. And so, like, I was just kind of, I was just sitting here praying and thinking, and, and I was like, man, you know, I think the next step in the process for me is to get to a point where I remain grateful for the struggles that I've been through. But to be at a point in my life and, and to be self-disciplined and to have the focus and the mentality so that God doesn't have to put me through those kind of struggles for me to be awake. So that I am awake. So that I'm making the right decisions and my focus is in the right areas and 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 then I can avoid those types of things. Um I just think that's that's the next step. I think that's like the next step in the in the process for me is is making sure that you know the next time the devil's throwing that carrot out in front of my face, waving it around, that I've got the self discipline, that I've got the right mentality to say, okay, you know what? Maybe the old me would have you know stared down that carrot and and been tempted. But the new me has got to understand that that's, that's not going to do me any good. That that carrot is not going to do me any good. And everybody's got their carrot. So I just refer to it as a carrot. Because some people, the carrot could be sex. Some people, the carrot could be money. Some carrots are, you know, lust and, you know, jealousy, hatred, uh, bitterness, um, revenge. There's all kinds of carrots out there and and different people have different carrots and, and the devil knows which one to use to get to you. And so he's gonna take the one and uh, and use it that's gonna be the easiest to grab you. So I've gotta be self-disciplined and understand that you know what, no matter no matter how tempting that carrot is for me, that I need to remain disciplined, focused, and and understand that in the end, if I want to avoid going through these struggles in the future, that I need to stay away, right? So I think that's big for me. I think that's kind of the next step is just understanding that. And so that's kind of what I'm praying for now is it's not necessarily that I don't want any struggles to occur in my life, but more so to help me have that mentality so that I can avoid those types of struggles. Right, because things are gonna happen in our lives. Like, I mean, stuff is gonna happen. Like that. That's just it's a fact. But there's a lot of things that happen in our lives that we self-inflict, that we bring upon ourselves. And so, if I can avoid the ones that I bring upon myself, and and just you know limit it to you know the nonsense that is just gonna happen, and I have no control over it then I think I'm doing pretty good there. And I think that's going to help me a lot. And it was just something that I was thinking about. And I was like, you know what? Uh, maybe I'll talk about this this morning because I really wasn't planning on making a video this morning. But um, nevertheless, it is Wednesday and the weather is just absolutely amazing today. Again, totally digging it. But uh, I'm going to keep grinding. I'm going to keep moving forward. And uh, I will always trust the process. I will talk to you all later. I'm out.